had some <laughs> high-flying, electrifying plays in this game. They're going to enjoy watching Andre Jackson play here this season. The freshman Hawkins is fouled on the putback, but eight in for the first time handling to his fellow freshman Johnson. And the third freshman, Hawkins, acrobatic for his first collegiate bucket. And look at his teammates all run over to him. That, that's the cohesion. Holly coming off a 17-point performance earlier this week against LIU. Now with 10 on the timer, here's the four-star prospect, Hawkins, looking the part. I mean, that is exactly what they want. John McGriff up to eight points. He has shown why he was originally a recruit to the Big East. Inside, tough finish and the foul. Second and five straight. And a name familiar to the UConn family, Tom Penders getting in as a coach. Now Hawkins, Jordan Hawkins from deep with his first three. Those players from the bench, a hockey line change for Dan Hurley. I think everyone's vaccinated. They'll get tested before they go down. They'll have to get tested when they come back. Hawkins. Hawkins. Hawkins into double figures. Jordan Hawkins for the first time in his Huskies career. Auburn is one of those teams in the mix. Yeah, Auburn could win it. They could finish sixth or seventh. The year Auburn went to the Final Four, they finished fifth in the league. Great play underneath. Hawkins used a head fake. And he's on the Williams, Moore, Jasper, and Kessler for Auburn. Again, six on the shot clock. Hawkins can do this. Knocks down a three. He's instant offense. We're going to call him the air fryer. Open. Hawkins lost the ball, regained it, fired again. Oh, my goodness. The air fryer. Two threes. And this is an element that Connecticut, although Bruce Pearl allows freedom for all of his players. Martin, left wrist banged up, fade away no good, gets his own rebound. And Hawkins already's got two of those. Look out! The air fryer is on fire. He's got 11 and three threes. It's the second shot defense, and Auburn has to be really good with 12 to go in this game. Hawkins, that is a tough shot. He got fouled. He's going to go to the free throw line. Just an offensive where it is, right? That's where it is. Okay. Hawkins, instead of shooting a three, hard to the hole. Oh, that's a pretty touch. That is a score right there. Hawkins again, two more. He knows exactly what he's going to do. Watch out. Here he comes again. This one should be a little easier. Cambridge challenged him, and he got hit hard, and now he grabs that left ankle of his. Eight. Pauly three. Too strong. Martin goes for it, knocks it. Keeps it alive. Hawkins to the hole. Left-hander, and that's instant offense again. What a play by Hawkins. He's in traffic. A couple runs, he was open for a second. Instead, into the corner it goes. Boy, Hawkins hung. He got fouled. He'll shoot some free throws. Good switch in the air by Hawkins from the right hand to the left. It's not easy. <laughs> that's why I'm showing them. But in a pool where there's no waves, it's pretty easy. Hawkins to the hole. There you go. You called for him first two minutes of the ball game. Four shooter hasn't been able to get it going. Just them both. Tack back in! And Hawkins looked like he hit his head on the floor. He came flying in there. They've stuck with this man to man just about the whole day. They've tried a couple of possessions his own. Hawkins got free. Hit a wide open triple. Yeah, Coach Hurley's team. We'll get into conference play in mid-December, and they've got to play West Virginia in their next game. Out of the corner, that shot is money. And that's Hawkins. Does extremely well. So Hawkins, with his sixth made three of the season, he shoots 38% from beyond the arc. One more time, and that one will fall for Hawkins. Couple of threes in the early going. A uh, time when they played in Phoenix in the, in the Chris Paul Challenge, it gave him some confidence, and he's really looking forward to them playing well today. The foul on the drive. They did get a per game, and that's fourth best in the Big East so far this season. Small sample size early on. Up and under. Style points for Hawkins. I tell you what, that young man... Grambling down to 43% shooting as a team, 41% for UConn. Hawkins makes sure that number is going up. I mean, she is just, she's on a roll. And, that, and I think, you know, it's picked up everybody the intensity all around the, the, 
loose. RJ Cole with the steal. Three ball, Hawkins. He's fouled on the shot. Bridges got him on the arm. It's three free throws coming up for the freshman Jordan Hawkins. Bounce out to Whaley, the long rebound for Connecticut. Here's the freshman Hawkins, and Hawkins fouled on the way up. He'll be bumped by Oshun Oshuni. It's been an offensively challenged first 12 points. Hawkins holds for four for the field. Another tough shot, but he draws a foul. He'll go to the line. Life is in first. Easy for you to say, Hawkins. There you go. Yeah, that's pretty. Man, I'm telling you, this kid has crazy power. He leaves it short. The 10 nothing UConn run. Hawkins again. Yeah, he sticks it from deep. Oh, my. Timeout bodies. Like, winning basketball games is, again, I talk about playmaking. The playmaking is between the lines, right? It, it's oh, no, between the, it's beneath the surface. That's another one. But his young kid, Jim Hawkins, good for him, breaking out a little bit. Over the last five minutes. And Providence is taking control for the moment. Down the lane, the freshman Hawkins, and he draws the foul. Reaching in. Gaffney leads it for Polly again. This one goes crying off the back iron. Hawkins with a foul. Jordan Hawkins, one of the kids picked up out of DeMatha in Maryland that has made a difference. Terrific piece for Seton Hall. Well, they just left Whaley alone. That's the reason he threw up a grip. Hawkins. You know, they, the Huskies are shooting 57%, Donnie. Someone they think very highly of within the program, looking for more minutes, looking for some consistency. They'll launch a three and bury it. Right on cue by the Huskies. We've been talking to Coach Early today. There's the steal. Yeah. Exactly what the Huskies want to do. Get out and run. Hawkins. Well, that's a... One of the keys is UConn needs to sustain uh, the effort, both offensively and defensively. And Jackson, again, just lost my appetite on that one, Timmy. <laughs> Hawkins, a little leaping leaner, and he hits the deck. That was a hard foul. And that hired uh, some of these outstanding young coaches, gave him an opportunity. Brad Stevens as well. Todd Licklider. Good find by Sadogo and Hawkins jams it home. And until Chuck Harris returns to form, yeah. he's in a bit of a shooting slump. Look at that. Nice Although, running banker from Hawkins. Other, but on game day, you know, some guys have better things to do than just talk with the announcers that are going to call the game. That's true. And Hawkins, oh, a beautiful move. That one hung on the rim. Cole races up ahead. Over to Hawkins for three. And a great job by Martin to track down the loose ball. Hawkins to a cook. What a feed from Jordan Hawkins. Freshman over to a cook, a cook. Rebound. It's tough to shoot a shot after that fake end. It could recalibrate. Hawkins for three. Long pass up ahead. And now Hawkins. His three is good. And Van Hurley calls timeout. That is a sweet looking stroke by the freshman Jordan Hawkins. Muhammad. Oh, what a rejection. It's the freshman Hawkins. Real great personality and uh, terrific guy. I've known him a long time. Boom. Hawkins again. Another three. Nice move and squeezes one into Johnson. Ah, I really like the game of Jordan Hawkins. Oh, Pete. Tremendous. So smooth. Xander, that's a tremendous combination. They get some help. They can beat a lot of teams. Hawkins for three. Oh, yes, God. and one. <laughs> Jordan Hawkins. Wow. Freshman. Chance for a four point play. Nice inside. Nice layup, Hawkins. With the feed. Good defensive stop to see if they can capitalize right here. Hawkins, beautiful. Uh oh, the three. Speed. Solid overall performance. 
Uh, this jump shot for Hawkins goes down. It's a three. Spin in practice on the line is and concentrated and focusing. See Hawkins with that beautiful stroke. Orsell right off the rim, almost a little bit beneath the rim. Transition three, put up, stroke through. It's another from the wing for the Huskies. It's here in the first half, up the front part of the rim. Hawkins transition triple. Wow. Well, how about that? Shot clock winding down. Hawkins pulls up from the elbow. Hawkins hits. Has made three of its last four. Xavier has made its last four shots. After a rocky start for both teams. Hawkins gets the friendly roll on the road. Boy, is that soft. Eight to shoot. Gaffney has got to hurry up. Baseline, cross court. Hawkins fades. They could certainly use that. No question about it. He did that the first game, Tom, right? He backed people in, physical. And Hawkins cans the first three of the night for either team. Yeah. Here's a rejection. Cole is down. He's hurt at the other baseline. Hawkins, count it. Cole slowly getting up. And the extra to Archie Diacono. On the drive. Rejected and tossed out of bounds. Jordan Hawkins. He's got to be careful. He jump shot too. It was sort of an unusual kind of a release, not a consistent one. Hawkins, known as a shooter, and the free throw line jumper falls. The youngster, little smile on his face. How about that? Maybe. Yeah, he's a transfer from the Citadel. Shoots a ton of threes. Hawkins on the attack oh. and the throwdown. Counted in the foul. Jordan Hawkins! I mean, it looked like he hung in the air a little bit extra there. I thought he was going to end up laying it. Right here, he kind of stops in midair, pulls it back. Uh, goodness. And, you know, Danny Hurley told us what he tells us before yeah. the game. This kid. The jump he's going to make from this year to next year, you will be shot. He could be one of the best players in the league next year. After making six consecutive buckets. Hawkins attacking again, and he's fouled. Seton Hall, and of course, the big one over number eight, Villanova, on Tuesday night. It's been a great run for UConn. Hawkins left alone in the corner. Can't do that with Jordan Hawkins. They came with the pressure. Grabbed by Martin. Another rebound. Nine seconds left. Shot clock turned off. This will hold it for the last one. Hawkins drives in and scores. An exclamation point on this first half for UConn. Holloway shot. Came out. That fresh, he's going to be freshman of the year in the league, by the way. He's tremendous. So UConn at Creighton, and then they finish at home against DePaul as Hawkins is fouled on the drive. 